Good morning. Let me get my coffee here. so I can wake up, um, be bright-eyed and bushy-tailed so I can get down the hill and, and uh, start working on the what happened in the cave. As you'll see in this video, I've done a lot of the caulking, caulking, however you want to say it. So I'm back down here. It's dark in here. And um, I'm going to be cutting off the... Off the ceiling. And you will see all the mundane stuff. Like cutting off the spray foam, I hate that job. And you'll see some pictures of where I did some more spray foam to give me more to cut off. Well, as you can see, I decided to go ahead and um, use spray foam in all of the cracks, the ones I can't see where they go to. And um, I'll go back and cut this off when it dries and just stucco all these little areas so that it looks like the rock and then paint it. I wanted to let you know I'm going to be decorating it in the theme of Narnia, spelled with N-A-R-N-E-A, -E not to be confused with Narnia, the Witch of the Road, or Wardrobe. That's for copyright. It's copyrighted. So anyway, but I'm going to be decorating some of the things down there with that theme because that was our son that passed away. It was his favorite place and he named it that. I wanted to thank the viewer that sent this cute little sign for the cabin. They didn't leave their name. Um, I was quite surprised, but I want to thank you so much for sending this. Uh, you certainly didn't have to, but it'll go awesome in that cabin. And since Narnia is the theme, I call it another Narnia, I'm going to decorate it um, with that kind of theme in mind. So this will go perfect. Thank you so much. I have some clever little things that I want to do, but that will come in the future. So stay tuned for this video. Hope this answers a lot of your questions. People, how are you going to keep the bugs out? Another question I get frequently. I seal everything up with cocky. Anyway, um, and I've done most of the stepheline. So 
some of the things I did not film. I was able to finish all the stucco and ceiling, the floor. Uh, yeah, so the floor is entirely sealed. There's no holes or gaps or layers or anything. They're all done because they are so, I mean, they're boring to me, so I figure they're gonna be boring to you as well. It's kind of like watching paint dry, but I know you wanna see the transformation. So I did take some still pictures. My next project in here is going to be, that I will record, will be um, finishing out these windows. Another question that I got is, how are you gonna seal the metal? So what I'm gonna do is I'm going to seal all the trim on the metal, around the metal, and then I'm going to seal all of the holes as well with coffee. So what I'm doing is going along and sealing the baseboard to the metal and half above as well. This is all clear, so it'll all dry clear and I'll wipe off the excess, of course. I'm going to be framing out those windows and I'm saying framing out, I'm, I finished them all, I finished it off. I'm going to finish off the two front windows today and work on the trim. If I can get everything done, um, we may move on to the paint. And so, yeah, once we get that done, it's just the floor. Installing this floor, and it is a vinyl floor, it's a gray floor. It's gonna go over here, of course, and up onto the bench. <laughs> Even though I didn't film it, I wanted to show you. I have all of this wall sealed and the baseboard and the trim boards all on and sealed. This all dries clear and is paintable and is smoothed out. And the inside of the cabin will be pretty much completed. But I want you to keep watching the series because and painting I you know I don't know painting's kind of boring but I may film some of it this is the color I'm going to be using I wanted it to be a grayish because the floor is a grayish and yeah I have a Ryan coming out today and he's going to be working on sealing the ceiling rock and the wall rock So Ryan's going through and he's using sealers very potent in here on all of this rock. How many do you have done? Um, from this shelf down. Oh, for one. There, down there. Oh, so you've done all this over here? Yeah, that's all sealed. All this is awesome. sealed. I just got to go up now. Well, I won't take that long then, will it? No, I don't. So, yeah, that's probably the hardest part. Yeah, that's why I wanted to make sure I had a flashlight so I could get all these yeah. purposes and cracks. Uh, I'm going to be working on a trim. In the background, all the water running in 
video, and that's because we had bad storms last night and torrential rain. So, it's it what it is. I can't do anything about it. And we're running off that cliff over there. I went back down to work on the windows and the trim and I couldn't breathe. It's too strong, the smell is too strong, so I'm gonna have to wait until tomorrow and I'm gonna put that on the next video. Um, so if you haven't liked and subscribed, you don't have to like it, but if you haven't subscribed, so you can follow this bill, please do so and leave a comment below. Even if it's a good job, bad job, I really don't care. Just it helps to get the video out further. And um, you know, it's a kind of a cool project. How many times do you get to see a cabin built where it's being built? Anyway, I appreciate you watching and Make sure you turn on those notifications so you can see when the next video is coming out. Thank you so much for watching and you have a blessed day.